Today, I'm going to be doing a what's in my gym bag video. Um, you're probably thinking, who are you and like, why do we care what's in your bag? Like, I'm just a normal person, stranger on the internet that really enjoys working out seven days a week. And, you know, I've been doing it for a while. So I feel like I've gathered a few essential gym items that I want to like show to you guys. And I love watching what's in my bag videos. Like ever since I was like, you know like 2017 like when that stuff was like popular i used to love it so like why not make my own it might still be entertaining you might still learn something from this also i'm not sure what the thumbnail of this video is going to be because if it's this purple gymshark bag then i lied um i thought i would use this for the thumbnail because it's like bright and cute i don't use this as my gym bag even though it's cute but it is like way too small for the amount of stuff I take. I actually use this bag from Walmart. Look at this. It is heavy, it is big, and it is inconvenient to take to the gym. And I'm sure people get annoyed when I just like put this on the ground next to the machine. But like, I don't care. Cause like I use some of the stuff in here. And when I say some of the stuff in here, I mean like literally one item that's in here i use but i just need the whole bag okay because what if one day randomly i need the thing that's at the very bottom of the bag and if i don't have this bag and i need that item i'm gonna be very pissed okay that will literally ruin my workout so i just take the whole bag with me just in case i need that very thing at the bottom of the bag that i haven't used in two years that being said i don't know what's in here because I have not cleaned it out. I have not looked at it like thoroughly in years. Not years. I have not looked at it thoroughly in like a year, okay? So in the top compartment, there's a zip and I just have my keys. I have this little candy pouch keychain that I got from Etsy and then my car key and then this Young LA keychain. I also then have this sunscreen by K skin. I don't know what this is. I think this is from like my Ipsy. Is that what we call it? Ipsy bags when I was subscribed to them. But I stopped that because I was just getting junk. So I was like, let me cancel this subscription. First of all, let me show you the, my lifting belt. Look at how cute that is. I got it from Hidden Village in the Iron. It's like an anime themed um gym accessory shop and like they have so many cute things highly recommend but let's see what's in the main compartment okay this is probably the most important thing you need in the gym and it is headphones headphones are so 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 important okay i personally cannot work out without music i cannot lock in without music and and oh my god you know what my biggest pet peeve is my biggest pet peeve is is when people come up to me to talk and i don't have headphones on so then you're forced to talk to these people but if you have these on no one is coming up to you actually people still come up to you and that's even more of a bigger pet peeve but like that's besides the point but like you know they just keep you like hey i'm not trying to talk get away but my headphones are the sony um, one of the sony headphones it was like 300 dollars, but highly recommend their noise cancellation and i cannot hear anything and i love it but sometimes i do get overstimulated and i have to take them off and then i just have to work out without music because it's like it's too much you know what i'm saying okay the next thing i have in here that i actually do use a lot are my ankle straps these ankle straps i'm sure you guys have seen them you attach them to the cable you put them on your ankles and you do kickbacks with them i really like these and they help so much on leg days okay next item is also a leg day item and it is knee sleeves let me turn them the right side for you one second okay knee sleeves these are also from hidden village in the iron and look at how cute they're pink and white and knee sleeves are just great if you're trying to like lift heavier 
and you want to like protect your knees you kind of want to make like the lift a little bit easier it's kind of like a cheat like for me personally like when i wear these i feel like i can like squat way more than i typically can typically than i typically can when i don't wear them so that's why i really like them they're not like a they're not like a necessity necessity but i enjoy wearing them because i feel like I can go heavier in weight and not be scared of hurting myself. That's the same with the belt too, the lifting belt. I just wear that to like protect myself if I'm feeling kind of like scared or if I'm like, mm, let me like, you know, like, you know, and just be protected. I also have a rotten Uncrustables in my bag. Mm. I told you, I've not been through this in forever. Oh, and then I also have Swedish Fish, which, oh, they haven't expired yet, which I'm actually surprised because they have been in here for a long, long, long time. So I guess I could still eat them. Good to know. Um, oh yeah, the next thing, I used to use this item all the time when these were like popular but then i stopped like seeing people use them so i was like wait maybe i don't need to use them but i think low-key i'm gonna start using them again because i did enjoy using them um these are just like those hip bands that you put around your legs and you can do glute activation workouts and you can like burn out with these on i really like i have them in like different intensities so one will be harder than the other i used to love using these so much but i think i just stopped seeing people use them so then i stopped too because i was like oh we're not doing that anymore but i need to start again i need to start again okay oh this next thing i have not used in forever because i did not like it it is these so essentially these are like hook grips you wrap it around your hand, okay? Okay, well, for, forget I wrapped, okay. So essentially you wrap it around your hand like this and when you go into deadlift, you can just grab the barbell with this hook and it should be easier for you to lift. But I have noticed that like, these kind of throw me off more than they help me just because I'm like not used to the like captain hook hooks like um, it just doesn't feel comfortable but i'm sure if you like practice with them um you know you'd get more comfortable and maybe you could lift heavier weights with it um okay oh the next thing is just a claw clip for my hair just in case i need it um oh this random arm jewelry that i have i think you just put it on your like bicep i don't know i thought it was cool but like i don't know why i thought i would wear this in the gym i don't know i don't know what i was going through or like what style i was trying to like go through but like why would i wear this at the gym like that's so uncomfortable i don't know okay i don't know um what else the next thing I have are wrist wraps. You just, you know, put it on your wrist, wrap this extra fabric around the bar, helps you pull it. It's kind of like the hook grips, but like not as intense. I don't know, they come in handy when you want to like RDO or deadlift, you know, just things like that. Okay, that is it for the main compartment. Now let's go to the miscellaneous drawers. Oh, this is a good purchase. This is a fan, like for your face, a face fan, I guess that's what you wanna call it, a mini fan. And you just... This really comes in handy when like the gym's AC is broken and you get really hot and you overheat because for me personally, I don't sweat, so like I'll literally just overheat. So this like helps cool me down. I totally forgot I had this bag in here. I guess with makeup items in it. 
okay i guess i have random lipsticks and hand lotions in here i had no idea i even had this pouch in here just random makeup things those are all the items that i have in my gym bag but another essential item i take with me is of course my water bottle i have to drink water while i work out um otherwise like i said i'm gonna overheat and pass out if i had to suggest maybe like one item you should definitely definitely have it would be okay let me make it two items i would invest in a good pair of headphones I try to go back to AirPods after using these and like AirPods did not cut it for me. I could hear everything and it was so annoying. So I would definitely recommend a really good pair of over the head headphones. And then I would also recommend angle straps. I feel like kickbacks on the cable are super underrated and I feel like they have a lot of um, benefits. So definitely angle straps. And all the other items are there to help you but they're definitely not necessary you can still like progress in the gym without the other items it's just kind of fun to have it's fun to like you know buy cute little gym accessories make your gym experience more fun more cute but like besides that if you're not trying to like really 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 like like if you're not trying to like compete in powerlifting or something like that, you don't need a lifting belt. You don't need knee sleeves. They're just there for fun to like see how much you can lift and to like kind of keep you safe if you are, you know, challenging yourself to like a crazy amount, you know, if that makes sense. But yeah, thanks for watching. I hope this was enjoyable. Um, but yeah, make sure you like and subscribe and I will see you in the next video.